Good evening, I'm Greg Floyd. Hi everyone, I'm Liz Bishop. A young couple from Colony is on a medical flight home right now after a disastrous honeymoon in the Dominican Republic. The newlyweds essentially got trapped after the husband fell ill and was rushed to the hospital. Our investigative reporter Jennifer Lukey spoke with their family tonight. Jen, what exactly is going on here? Well, this is just a devastating example of what can happen when you're traveling internationally and you have a medical emergency. Your insurance card is basically useless in most other countries. You pay for everything up front and you just don't know what kind of care you're going to get. These newlyweds will be home around 1.30 a.m., but what they've been through over the last few days is heartbreaking. The wedding was Saturday. The wedding was perfect. Everything went wonderful. The bride and groom, Caitlin and Tommy, headed to the Dominican Republic for their honeymoon on Monday. Tommy's such a hardworking guy. He has two jobs. So he's never had five days off in a row. So this was like going to be, they were so looking forward to it because he's never had a vacation. But shortly after they got there, he got sick. And at 3.30 in the morning, she called me that he was so bad she didn't know what to do. He was he was severely sick, he is vomiting, he couldn't straighten up, he's in pain, he's rolling around. They rebooked their flight home for the next day, but... She gets out to the lobby to get him to check out, you know, from the resort and get the cab and he collapses on the floor. He was taken by ambulance to a local hospital in Punta Cana, but the young couple had to pay thousands just to get in the door. Tommy has Crohn's disease. It's likely his illness is related to that, but doctors in the Dominican really aren't sure. You don't know if he has an obstruction, if he has a, a perforation, is it going to just keep getting worse? So far, he hasn't gotten any better. And they said it, commercial airlines will not let him on in this condition. They're not going to put a patient on. So the newlyweds were essentially stuck. Stay at a foreign hospital, paying thousands of dollars out of pocket for treatment that's not working, or get home to specialists here in Albany that know how to best treat Crohn's. Now help me, Mom. Do something, Mom, if you're trying. The couple's plight has spread fast on social media. Dozens of friends and family members donating money for the medical flight home. But with a price tag of $29,000, the family also had to take out a loan. Right now, though, all Kathy can think about is seeing her daughter and new son-in-law. I'm just, thank God you're home. Thank God you're home. The med flight lands in a few hours. Tommy will be brought directly to St. Peter's Hospital where a team is ready for his arrival. The 29 grand for the flight had to be paid up front. The family may be able to get some reimbursements from their insurance company, but probably not much. Caitlin and Tommy used all of their wedding money to pay for the hospital stay in the Dominican. Friends have set up a fundraising page for them. We'll link you to it at CBS6Albany.com. Liz.